Fellow Metalheads, welcome back to Ballhead of Metal. Today, let's do another Sabaton reaction to the song Bismarck, the official music video. I really enjoyed the, the Christmas Truce song and the music video. It was really well shot and I enjoyed the song. For those who are new to this channel, I do know who Sabaton is, but I'm not. The only thing I know about them is I've seen them in concert two or three times because they uh, co headlined with like Iced Earth. And I'm trying to remember the other bands I saw them with, but I've seen a couple times and I loved uh, Joachim's performance and kind of energy that he brought to the band and his vocal performance and just the band's fun factor overall. There was just so much fun to watch. Uh, but I can't tell you if I know a particular song if I've heard it So because I've only seen things in concert. So I'm going to check this one out, see what it's all about, see if I like it. We'll go from there. Just be prepared that if I voice my opinion, I might like some stuff, might dislike some stuff. Let's have a conversation. We'll see as I break down the certain elements, what, how I react to each of the elements that we got here. Anywho, without any further ado, let's do this. Yeah, that's them. I've seen them in that outfit before. So, did you find the boat? <laughs> I really do enjoy their effort, how much effort they put into creating music videos because I've mentioned this quite a lot on this channel. I love a good music video and there's a shortage in any genre of a really, really good music video. Starting epic. metal music video on the boat <laughs> his move that he does with the slamming his fist on his thigh and that kind of epic pose that he has very reminiscent of like 80s except oh, i love it I, I i love the they take themselves not too seriously they know how to have fun and kind of poke fun at each other but at the same time they put a lot of effort into their their music videos their music and everything overall and it just has a fun right away from the beginning super fun I'm impressed how good the CG is too. <laughs> Usually the, the music videos have like cheap CG. They put a lot of money into this. And yeah, this they probably are going to definitely on my reaction channel so far out of everything I've seen. They're most likely going to win the best music video award 100%. Across the sand 
I'm guessing it's about a particular boat called Bismarck. It's probably for the U.S. Navy when they were fighting the uh, Axis, particularly Japan. Uh, I'm, that's what I'm going to guess about. I mean, obviously, I get that much from the fact that it's about a particular boat and the importance they had in the battle. <laughs> I find it funny too because um, I'm a big gamer myself. Now though, Sabaton was one of the like the sponsors. They made a music video I remember for War Thunder. I think was it uh, the game War Thunder, free to play uh, ship and like airplane game uh, based in World War II and different eras. So it's kind of funny to see that kind of cross going on. This also happened, I believe, in uh, with Blind Guardian in an RPG Sacred 2. They created literally a song for the game. I like these kinds of good things because it's both mediums that I really enjoy a lot. Uh, and it lends themselves to that as well. Epic. It's just as epic live as it is to see in the music video. What a happy accident is this that he started as a keyboard player for the band it became the vocalist and kind of the front man just based off his energy what a happy accident was that uh that's that's it happens a couple times in various bands where this unexpected element enters the band it just completely their energy so in camp like you know like they they they, they, they bring so much charisma to the table that you can't help but like yeah they need to pick forth and take charge because it's going to give that texture to the band that we haven't had before. I wonder what their first vocalist was like before him or what the whole band was like in general. <laughs> This, this is definitely a band, a perfect example of a really good power metal band. Uh, and I would classify them as power metal. I mean, that's not important, but I'm just saying this is just a, such a good example of this fun energy. I remember getting the same feeling when I saw Ale Storm live. They're just so much fun. That's exactly why I was into metal. And that sometimes you want the serious political uh, lyrics, and sometimes you just get this, which it still has su uh, historical significance. But it has this fun factor to it that has been lost in music, I believe, in many, many genres for a while. They took, they took themselves too seriously. 
they forgot how to have fun their stage performance is just it was so energetic so i am a 100 on board with sabaton probably one of my favorite recommendations from you guys so far uh it's sabaton overall and it's only been two songs because i enjoy this kind of a sound and i definitely need to be getting into this band uh yeah i have nothing else to say i don't have anything negative to say really uh good music video great performance good playing songs are i want to say simple i think that's 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 a wrong word to use that they, they have this kind of classic power metal structure uh they 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 get your attention with how good it sounds versus trying to impress you with a different kind of a sound like something like gojira would do or uh orbit culture would do you know uh but i love it i love it so much that's, it. that's all i gotta say hopefully you guys enjoyed this reaction and if you did be sure to subscribe down below for more guys enjoy the rest of your day keep it metal enjoy the holidays